ABC2 News. Good morning, Maryland. All right, good morning, Maryland. Ahead of us here on Good Morning, Maryland. Take a look at this. Imagine this stuff around your neck, circling your finger. Imagine these jewels in your dresser. Hey, we're going to be back to talk to Jason about jewels in your dresser right after this. All right, welcome back. Say hello to Jason. He's our jewelry expert. He's part of the Gem and Jewelry Show going on at the Convention Center. Starts today, right, Jason? Uh, starts today at noon, yes. All going right. Through Sunday. Take a look at these samples here. All right, it started right over here. We want to get to the great stuff. Uh, but this is all for, these items are for sale, All right? these items are for sale. Um, yes, all, uh, all available to the public uh, through Sunday. Uh, we'll start here with some diamonds. Of course, diamonds are always popular, but colored diamonds uh, seem to be back in the news uh, recently with uh, Jennifer Lopez with her six carat pink uh -huh, colored stone. Uh -huh. Here I have uh, some regular diamonds along with some canary uh, diamonds, uh, yeah. sort of dark yellow. Here are some loose brown diamonds, loose even more brown rare. Diamonds. That, those are rare? Those are very rare and even more rare, uh, I don't know if you can get a shot of this, it's a yeah, heart right pendant with very small yeah, orange. Yeah, put it right down on the table, Jason. Very small orange diamonds. Extremely rare, right extremely there. valuable. And then we have the rings. Oh, we have some rings. Uh, we have a garnet, uh, Savorite garnet, uh, worth about uh, $1,500. Uh, we have um, some uh, tourmaline, tourmaline uh, earrings and necklace. Uh, tourmaline has uh, become popular again. It uh, comes in uh, pink, uh, green, and red. Yeah. Um, what, you're, what you're looking at is uh, an agate uh, bead uh, necklace. Beads are becoming popular again. Uh, they've really been popular since the 20s, but they've seen uh, somewhat of a resurgence in the last few years, and a lot of our dealers are dealing in beads. Uh, beads are anything from, rocks. from agate yes. to turquoise to yeah. uh, topaz with uh, quartz. Um, then we get to the real, look at this. Yes. Now, the, the, we are talking about celebrities here, the cobra. The cobra, this uh, cobra so pin this. is uh, go solid gold with uh, diamonds and rubies. It was uh, Sylvester Stallone's gift to his uh, then wife, Bridget Nielsen, during ah, the filming huh? of his ah. famous film, Cobra. Now you got time. us, <laughs> ah, forget the rocks. Yeah. Now you got the now cobra got us. Um, these uh, earrings are, uh, from the collection of Marilyn Monroe, they're rhinestone. Wow. How'd you get those? Uh, we got those through oh, auction. Here. <laughs> yes, and actually many of our uh, collection, the fabulous jewelry of the stars, will be um, available to, to look at for the public. Those, the, but the earrings are for sale. They're not for sale. <laughs> no, no, no. Okay, <laughs> and then the crowns, look at these. Yes, this is uh, obviously the uh, the biggest part of our collection, These uh, the Romanov crowns uh, worn by the Tsar and the Tsarina look at of Russia. Any it's idea how much those would be worth? Uh, together, close to a million, probably maybe more than a million dollars. Step uh, back, everybody. Look at that. A million. Uh, both of them together? Are both of them together, or? yes. Pearls, uh, turquoise. Uh, they're over, uh, over, well over 100 years old. And um, very, very valuable. That is incredible. And they're going to have uh, other stuff out there. Mary Pickford, uh, Jimmy Stewart, Mae West, and Cher's bracelets. <laughs> All there. <laughs> how many how many share bracelets do you have? Uh, we've got <laughs> quite a few, I think. <laughs> oh, man. Jack Nicholson, Barbara Streisand, Lucille Ball. So it's going to be riches and power, the jewels of the rich and famous. That's really neat. Mm -hmm. Jason, it'll be tonight, today. It uh, starts today at noon, right? It starts noon through 7, and also uh, Saturday and Sunday. Great uh, for people looking for Mother's Day gifts, uh, graduation presents, or just gifts for themselves. All right, and this is going to be going on at the Convention Center. Baltimore tell Convention you, Center. I remember as a little kid, I used to go to the Pikesville Armory <laughs> for the gem and, and jewelry show. And that's where we used to have to collect rocks and get your geodes cut in half. <laughs> you know what we're talking about.